it's your girl Mick Yee, 360 Radio, Connected Radio, the Yee area. We're here tonight. It's a beautiful Monday night. Um, got Tap in here to Hello. co-host tonight. Welcome back. Thank you for having me. The Nuptial King. Um, <laughs> make sure you guys go visit True, True, True Goddess, Beauty, Goddess Supply. Beauty Supply in Stockton. That is his domain okay, okay. and shout out to wifey she's beautiful i love her she was uh, when i met her she's like i've heard so much about you i was like same so it was nice to meet her and then in the building tonight let's tell who we are and where we're from you go first Mo. young bosses here from sacramento young bosses what's your name young boss simone simone so that's if you ever correct need to, if you ever need to talk to simone she's under young bosses on instagram and then who's to my right Crystal, three times, also known as C3X. C3X, cut the check. <laughs> cut the check. She on their neck. Right. <laughs> she is also my co-host. We're hosting the Bars Up event this Saturday, so she is a host as well. Um, she is also, Crystal is a, a plethora of talents because she's a, she is a host, she's an artist, so she will be performing and I, are you going to be doing the um, cipher? Are you in the challenge? No, 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 no. Just, just performance. performance. Okay, mm-hmm. dope. So she's got a uh, performance and everything going on that day too. But the let's tell them what the event is. What is bars up? Bars Up is an event where young talent comes out. I give you guys a platform where you guys can perform a cipher and battle rap. So that's two people going head to head battling each other. So you definitely don't want to miss that. We have King Leo versus Losi the Boat and Zoo Boy versus Rick is Raw. Mm, that so sounds definitely. Fun. Yes, yes, yes. And um I saw on your um on your advertisement that um, Sleep Dank's going to be coming out. Yes, Sleep Dank will be there uh, performing, and he's also looking to opponent. Yeah, to he's, a, he's a battle rapper. He's a battle rapper, too. Yeah, I've seen him do it. It's pretty dope. <laughs> so shout out to, to Sleep of the of the Thiz Nation. Um, and then the, the star of the show is Mac Mall. Correct, he's, correct. This is his, he's, he's coming out, and definitely shout out to him. Mac Mall's a wonderful, wonderful person. Love him. Every time we call him, he is right there. There on the spot give me the date and time and i'll be there like yourself Thank shout you. out to um crystal three times and shout out look at me i'm getting all stuck on my <laughs> it's all good the shout cool, out to a, mickey just call her the croc she cougar is always there and on time they um they used to call me the croc cougar around here we gotta the bring croc it back cougar, yeah. what's that about <laughs> yeah so just <laughs> I happened to send the wrong gibbets to the wrong person, and he got upset because they were not his initial. Because I get my, I get all my dudes Crocs so that they have something nice to lounge around in in the house. Okay. And that's I your, sent that's your award. I you sent a saying? gift and I sent the wrong shit, so I got kind of side busted out. So Ooh. sorry, but that's why he calls me the Croc Cougar. Yeah, it's, it's forever stamped. You know what I'm saying? The now there's a reward. You mess with ye, you get you the get Crocs. Crocs. That's you know why everybody saying? looks at all the artists that come in here, and if they're in Crocs, they look at me like, and I'm all, nah, man. <laughs> Okay, okay. Listen, it took me seven years to kill the uh, reputation of Katie out here, right. so she's gone. Uh, it's MC Yee now. MC Yee. Yeah, that's correct. Love her, love her, love Thank her. Thank you. So let's talk about some of the artists that are going to be performing that day. Can, do you have, like, a, you have them on top of your head? Oh, my God. We have Max 17. We have Spittles coming out. Um, King Leo will be out there. Heat Gotham will be out there. Shake that thing. Hey, I love him. He will be out there doing doing that crystal three times will be out yeah. there um it, it's a lot a lot a lot sleep dank is out there he's actually going to perform as well um it's just a lot and where is this uh, take, uh where is this located where is the event taking place um 3514 broadway and it's at the old park brewery you can't miss it um right by fixins and the gill right between there Cannot mm. miss it. This is going on our fourth one coming out. And from what I've heard, I mean, I'm there and I really don't know. But everybody tells me that they have a good time. Yeah. What y'all say, Katie? When we're, I mean, we're all of us, when we're there, we're working. So we can't really see, like, how people are in, experiencing the event. But I think it's dope. Like, everybody has fun. There's good food there. So who's, who's serving food? Yes. We have Bird's Barbecue and Ace's Place put that together. And you get bars up 
up food. Mm -hmm. Chicken and fries, <laughs> fish and fries. <laughs> I got to tell you guys, one time there was, we didn't have any problems, but there was a small argument about in the back, and we were like, oh, my God, what's going on? <laughs> they were arguing about the chicken, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> was no more chicken. <laughs> uh, uh, that is a problem. <laughs> yes, that yes, problem. yes. How did you meet um, Simone? Um, I met her. Uh, when did I meet you at an event? It was my event. You, you know, hosted event. it. Yes, yeah, yes, 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 yes. I met her at the, uh, the bars up the first one, which was epic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's just been solid ever since, so I just keep rocking with her. That's like, right. it, it don't matter. When she hit me up, I'm going to be there just like today. She told me this the other day, and I said, I'm going to be here. So yep, yep, yep. that's how we met, and so we just been rocking ever since. So for those people out there that don't know, who are you and where are you from? Um, well, I'm Crystal, Crystal three times. I'm from Stockton, California. Hey. <laughs> hey, hey, Stockton in the building. But, um, excuse me, my voice is a little messed it's up. It's okay. Today. Is it because but of that new song you had got dropped today? Yeah, yeah, I was screaming. I was screaming, screaming when, I all over. <laughs> when I see the producers drop it. So, um, what song is it? It's called uh, Give Me My Money. It's for the culture. Give me my money. Everybody. Give me my money. Give me my money. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I think uh, I, no. Yeah, yeah, I've seen mm -hmm. that. So you, did you send that to Eddie so yep, we can play it? it Super dope. Mm -hmm. So we've got a yes. brand new drop from Crystal <laughs> yes, on here. Right? I'm yes. excited. So she's also, uh, she does a host events. She does hair. She does sure. um, photography. You are um, an artist. What else? What am I missing? Comedy. Um, oh, yeah, I do a little comedy. Yeah, a Everything. Lot. <laughs> she did a back and did some... A lot of comedy. I yeah. do a comedy. Lots of comedy. Um, a lot of comedy. Just a lot of kids. Uh, I'm kids. Um, I do a little bit of everything. I just do a lot, you know, doing a lot in the community also. And then that's why I wanted to be a part of the uh, Bars Up because... She brings a lot to the community, and plus giving out scholarships, mm -hmm. correct. giving back, Let's talk making about sure the scholarship. she's giving correct. money. And I, to be honest, though, when she gave away that money on the last um, cipher, I was kind of upset. Oh, yeah, we're going to talk about that. <laughs> oh, right let's now. talk about oh, yeah, it. Gonna get in because Is that King, because somebody King, jumped in? Nah, King Leo, he did he did his thing, but I think my girl, Madam Max, should have took that money. You understand yeah. me? I don't I, stand on that. Yep, I want to say I don't have that. anything to do with the judges. Yeah, That's why I'm not you involved don't. with that. But <laughs> I have to say her girl rocked the mic. Um, mm -hmm. I kind of stopped in my tracks. And when I stop in my tracks, that means there's something going on. And mm -hmm. she did rock the mic. She did. They told she her to did. come back. She stopped. Yes. Yes. And I was one back. of them to say, come her. back. She surprised me. <laughs> she really, really surprised right. me. Well, I know one girl came up and started, um, took the mic and started rapping because she said yes. she wanted to rap in front of Ma. In front of Ma. That's why and I say Ma. She grabbed it. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. So oh, my God. Ma was like, yes. Ma was like Yes. Going on? Go, go. Ma, if Ma. you ever feel like you ain't got it, I'm here to tell you, Man, you she still been wanting to got it. She was six years old, and she said that she was like, "When I was a little kid, this is my dream." Yes, so you feel yes. me? I guess she had to so take she had her, her a, moment. She had a little Beyonce moment. <laughs> big Beyonce, Beyonce moment. moment. Big she, Beyonce moment. I was I'm giving crying. out awards, and she snatched the mic from me and said, oh, no, I got to perform. Oh, no, no, that's and, so much. And, and, and it was a good verse. She got a few verses out. Yeah, but we she, had to just, cut the ch we had to cut it. <laughs> my, question, my question to you is, what made you want to start this event? What, um, because I used to cheer, um, be a cheerleading coach okay. and um, that in Pop Warner. And when the kids got finished with that at 14, they don't have nothing to do. So mm -hmm. from that point up, we kind of like kept them um, on a walking straight and narrow, okay. you know. And mm -hmm. then that's when it, the trouble starts. Yeah. So now if we keep them involved and keep showing them, y'all still d give us your talents. Let's do something. Let's work. Stay out of trouble. Give them something to do. So this is what I did. And it raises money to give back to them, to the kids that are less fortunate or I won't say less fortunate but are having trouble paying that fee got it mm -hmm. so that's, that's what the that's scholarships is about yeah and I do have a kid in mind and hopefully um, to be honest it's hard to get them to come get the money I don't understand mm -hmm. it so if y'all out there know somebody I can have a backup person there have them come out there in case my person doesn't show they can definitely get that $150 scholarship for them right. and plus mm -hmm. there's more because there's a lot of people out here willing to give you kind words mm -hmm. on there and how to be successful well I'll donate an interview right now 
Yeah. See what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. There, there it is. There, there's Katie. See, see, I'm gonna do the see? hair. She do the hair. Look at I donate the products. See, I got the products. The pretty bun. Yes, 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 yes. Well, that's dope. <laughs> Mars Up is a really cool event. Like when we are out there, and I think it's going to be uh, better this year because it's later in the in the summer. Not so, so hot. So it's not as hot as it. But it wasn't even really that hot last time. But you mm-hmm. know, we'd be whining and shit. So Calif- <laughs> Northern California, we're spoiled. You know, we got the Indian summer. It should be <laughs> November. It'd right. be 100 degrees outside. Well, right. this at least in September, it's going to be cooler than it was in um, August because it was like 120 in August. So I'm over right, that. Right. Right. I'm over that. Um, as far as like uh, Access Sacramento, I know they're coming out to to record the event. Well, this time they're gonna let us record it. Oh, and Sack it. Boy and Emo, shout out to them because they will be doing the footage for that. And shout out to Emo, all the flyers y'all been seeing the video so far. That is his creation. I'm talking in my phone. That is his creation. <laughs> and then we have Sack Boy coming out. He's gonna do some footage, and we're gonna send it over them to Access TV, and then they'll publish it. So we have control of that oh, now. I'm sorry. You're fine. You're oh. Super, super happy about wow. that. This yes, the, uh, yes. This is the most laid back interview I've ever had. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you can probably like that. You got lighter. <laughs> we don't need you to add to a little bit to the. <laughs> you got lighter. <laughs> Goldie lighter. Gold gave us that little, that key oh, roll joint right there. Nice. It's called. Frosted Donuts. <laughs> Shout out to Goldie Gold from the Federation. I got a light of it. Oh, here we go with the light light. Let me brag real quick. Let me brag real quick because we brag different around here, right? Listen to this drop I got. This drop is epic. Is it going to play? God damn it. Because I didn't have my music up. Make sure it's not a, you know what I'm saying? It's a PG verse. Shut up. You know kind of drops you like. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> I got the Goldie drop. That was like so crucial to me to get that. Kicking it in here. Definitely in the building. Radio. Tap. You got any questions about the bars up? Um, man. Are you going? Yeah. No. You know what? You know what? No. Let me tell you. I ain't be able to make it because you know. Let me tell you why, because you know, oh. I, I, run my, I run my store on the weekend. Okay, okay. My mother-in-law does it, okay. you know, during the week, and I take over for the weekend. Send so wifey okay. to the show. Yeah, I can send. Yeah. I, mean, I can always, baby. you know, you know, if I need to be there, I can. I can always make a swap. You know what I mean? Okay. For a couple okay. hours or something. Yeah, a couple of hours. We would love to have you there. Come check it out. Take some photos. Let Sack Boy get some photos. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, what's the next event for you, Simone? What's your plans after this bo- the fourth annual? Like, do you plan on taking it any further? Definitely, definitely. I plan on, we're going to be back out again. We normally do it twice a year um, in April and in September. Um, Try to do the cool times of it, but we want to see how this one goes. I'm getting so much, so much attention, and um, a young lady texted me today and said, thank you for doing what you're doing. Keep doing it. You're giving people like me, I'm a single parent, a platform to come out and perform. Please don't stop. Yeah. And Crystal three times also told me the same thing today. Keep it going. Matter of fact, talk about it. Oh, yeah. No, I called her and I just, I know because I go through it a lot. Um, you know, being around uh, people where they, they don't know you, they don't know where you come from. And I always tell people, like, what I heard before, we all fight in a battle that's just not, you can't yeah. see. Yeah. Everybody, you feel me? So when I was telling her, like, everybody wants you to do good, but they don't want you to do better than them. Hey, still, you just gotta do what you gotta do because if you don't, then how you how you gonna breathe for real? Like you just might as well just lay down and die. For real, man. you feel right, me? Like, right. That's why I say I keep on pushing. <laughs> the CMX ain't gonna stop. Everything I do with my business partners, with with my partner Vibe, with 4K Frey, with everybody that I do business with, with y'all. I'm going to just keep it genuine. And the genuine people going to be there throughout your whole life. It don't even matter. They're not going nowhere. Absolutely. Right. right, Well, let's go into her song, and then we'll come back in and let the people know how to get tickets and what time we're starting. Okay. Did you send the song? Yes, I did. Did you send it to the 360 Radio at Gmail? Yes, I did. Okay. Do you have an airdrop? Yes, I do. It should be in the 360 Radio at Gmail.com. 
Okay, she's going to airdrop it too. It should say DJ's MacBook Pro. So um, what time does the event start? So the event will start at 1 p.m. Yeah, sharp. Perfect, because perfect. we have so many performers, yeah. we have to start at 1 p.m. sharp so that we can um, get finished at a time where we still have light for the photography and for the battle. Um, the one, the first battle is going to be around two, uh, two thirty, I believe, and uh, we're going to do some performers and a cipher. Um, that'll be right after the battles, and then the end of the performers, and then Maul and Sleep Dank will do their thing and close it out for us. Um, I believe so far we only have like five contesters for the cipher. Mm -hmm. That's the five hundred dollar cash. So if you want to jump on, it's still open. Only five. They better get up on there. That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna get up on there. And I might get up on there and do a cipher for five hundred. I might. I got cougars. I got Crocs. I got Nibbles. I want a lady to win this time. Talk about it. I want a lady to win this time. Talk I'm, about it. I'm going to sing gospel, though. <laughs> okay. Okay, the whole now. Well, that beat is going to be yeah, there. I'm so, sorry. And I'm telling everybody, if you're if you're watching right now, um, we don't give you your time slots. You have to show up and write mm -hmm. your name down mm -hmm. because we're, we're going to be moving. And if you're not there, we're not going to hold your spot for you. You have to be present. Sign up. Get your name. Your photo will be taken so that the judges can match a name to the photo. Right. Um, what beat did you guys choose and how did you choose it? So, me and Emo, um, we sat down and we listened to tons and tons Shout out of Emo, beats. legendary yes, person yes. out here, staple. He does it all. Team. If you guys need your photos done, you need your movie done, whatever, he got <laughs> you. But, um, yeah, we sat down and we, yes, we was just jotting course. down like one, two, three, four, five. And then we heard this one beat where we both was grooving and we couldn't even stop. We was like, that's it. That's it. We, <laughs> we got to be. We don't even need to listen no more. So right. that's how the beat came out. And for me, you guys, I like something. Because we have to listen to it all day, I like something that we're going to just rock to all day long. We ain't going to never get tired of that beat mm -hmm. oh. all day long. Mm -hmm. So that's what it was. Nice. Okay, mm -hmm. so that starts at 1. Correct. And we're going till what, like 7? Correct. Correct. And then for everybody who's coming in to, just to see, particularly to see this event and that they are coming to see Mall. Mm -hmm. um, he has another show in Sacramento that night. So uh, we'll be co going from, I say will, because I'm in his party. Yeah. I'm in his entourage. <laughs> we'll be going from um, the Bars Up event to dinner, and then we're going to be going from dinner to this uh, birthday party that's out here. And actually, Doobie is coming to the birthday party as well. So he may very well be at the Bars Up event because right. he's got a show out here um, that night. So that's a lot of people from the Crest are going to be out in Sacramento kicking it. Uh, Governor's Circle, I'll get you the information. Make sure you let me know if you're interested because we can get you the information of how to go see them perform. So that will be like two events in one on Saturday. But let's go ahead. We do have the song in. So Crystal, let them know something about the song before we play it. Okay, so the song, uh, my producer um, sent it to me, and um, he's actually, I'm actually working with a, a, a new producer, too. Uh, um, <laughs> Y'all are silly. <laughs> she can I'm just smoke. kidding. She can smoke and do ever, all that so stuff. So his name is Grizz LaFleur, <laughs> and I met him before, and he's out of uh, Philly. Grizz so, LaFleur, uh, what a yeah, name. Yeah, right? He looks like Morpheus. <laughs> <laughs> he tall as hell. He, he, said, <laughs> he got locks. He, he tall. But look, he got some good heat for us. And then everybody Ooh, doing the challenge on TikTok. Like so I just figured, you know, why I want to just jump in. And as soon as I heard the beat, I was like, give me my money. Give me my money. Just give me my money. And so as soon as I heard that, I did that. And, you know, we all had collaborations. My partner Whip helped me on it, too. Gave me shout a little, out to you Whip. Know, shout out to Whip. Everybody that's collabed on it is, you know, the guys, they know they what they want to hear from a lady. So I let them shoot me a little something, and, you know, I said it. But... Overall, you know, this is me. So we're going to get into that. What's, okay. the, what's the title? Get my I money. I like oh, it. Get, get my, my money. Run that in. $20 to get in. There you go. <laughs> Say that. The yeah. Domino Tournament, $25 to get in, $300 prize. But once you get in there, you will definitely have a great, great, great time. Or you can go on Eventbrite. It's 15 to get in. And nobody has beat the Domino Champ yet. They ain't nope. got an Uno Tournament? Not once. Hey, a Uno Tournament? I'll draw for somebody asked that. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm so stupid. They asked the death. Tap. <laughs> we need to throw a party and have a domino. Yeah. I mean, have a Uno, Uno turn up. You should. I draw for they ass quick. <laughs> Do you know a lot of people that like to play? It gets it gets serious. There's a lot it of people out here. Because I'm serious. thinking of I want to do game night sometime. Well, what we, we need to do, night. I know we have smoothies at the at bars up. Correct. Shout out to the smoothies. But his sister actually makes mixed drinks. It's called it's called um, Mina made it. Mm -hmm. Mina made it. And okay. she does dope ass collab like infusion drinks. So mm -hmm. she made one for me, and it was called the Croc Cougar, yeah. and it was green, <laughs> and it used to fuck us <laughs> up. <laughs> I used to be in here. I rack. want some she of the Croc. Cougar. She makes drinks. So she maybe we can bring her to the bars up next time. Okay, yeah. okay. So she can sell some drinks. Is she trying to do all that right now? She, she, yeah, she, made, the drink, she made the drinks from my wedding. That's I know. That's why what were the, the wedding two was... cocktails called? It was a girl's cocktail. The, one, the, girl, the girl cocktail is called She Ready. Yep. <laughs> she ready. <laughs> and then the other one is called a Henny Maid. So a Henny like, Maid. Hey. Like I said, it was so. It was the drinks had us forget. We forgot to cut the cake. <laughs> they did. We, we, we still got cupcakes. So. You know what I'm saying? But listen, he walked down the aisle too, <laughs> wide open by Mac Mall. Definitely. Hey. Hey. I said you should have told me. I would have brought him <laughs> to the wedding. This is right. This is a real Bay Area guy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> real, real Bay Area, Bay Area guy. guy. It was I'm super shout out to Mall. Always yeah, and saying, forever. Real big coming out guy. and uh, supporting. Mm -hmm. Well, anything you guys want to, anything you're promoting? Any shows or anything coming up? Um, I have my Thirsty Thursdays pop in like every last Thursday of the month. Come and it's, it's in Stockton. It's always a good time. What's a um, Thirsty Thursday? Thirsty Thursday. Thirsty Thursday. Yeah. Oh. Thirsty Thursday. Okay, so I'm have, sorry. Um, you know, we have entertainers. We have girls. You know, I, I have my own entertainment company along with my business partner, Madam Matt. And um, we just been rocking. And I ha we have our third annual um, fashion show coming up. Mm -hmm. So we're debating if we're going to do it in October, which is the Halloween theme. Because mm -hmm. we, well, we call be it fun. an exotic fashion show. Mm -hmm. So we might do it during there. But, um, yeah, so that's just the only thing that's coming up with that. And then... Hopefully, y'all, please. I don't even like putting stuff out there like this, but hopefully, I pass this class on Wednesday. Passing it. I've been in <laughs> school, y'all, so um, I get up. my certificate on Wednesday. So and and I take my my test. So hopefully, I do that, and, and that's pretty much you it. it. <laughs> Lots of stuff popping. <laughs> Lots of you stuff popping. You got it. I got the got um, it. I got the twenty eight. I got the bars up, of course, this Saturday, and yeah. I've got and uh, right after that the malls. The Mac Malls concert. Um, it's gonna be a birthday party for a person out here so it's gonna be lit and then the 28th actually i have a show at um it's it's on florin it's all things indie showcase and it's our 14 year anniversary that show oh, terrence right. keith is the, the star um taji d is pushing up mm -hmm. he'll be there mm -hmm. so uh i'm a host uh dj lr on the beat um we need everybody to pull up and support all things indie because that's what oh. we do you oh. feel me shout I, out hooker boy on the line i, I, I see you Lisa on the boy. line i forgot what is that um you have a show coming up with um oh be cool. Be cool. What's that song? Oh, be cool. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> no. <laughs> don't mess with me. Uh, uh, you talking you about... Uh, you don't want to... Pro you talking about... Yes, you don't want no Yes, you're going to interview him. Mr. Fab? No. That's not him. You said, said be cool. Is that him? Are yeah. you talking okay. about Bathgate? Cool. Yeah, no, Mr. Fab then. No, yeah. I don't know. I, I, wish I, have have I wish I have a Fab yeah. interview. Yeah, you, you do. Fab, come out here. Yeah. <laughs> I have interviewed Fab on at? the phone, but I'd love to interview him live. Oh, he gonna come here? Uh, Where you at? Nah. Hey, Fab. <laughs> Fab, actually, Fab, I booked Fab. I've been fucking with Fab for a long time. Mm. And if you, if I walk into the Dope Era store, just know I fuck with you because mm. that's a long walk from the car to the store, and my bitch ass don't like to walk <laughs> nowhere. <laughs> But I hook it every time to get to the to he's a see them. Aquarius, so he gonna come do this interview. Oh, I love Fabby. Fabby is actually, um, I really feel like he should be more uh, upfront in like literature about how important he is to this culture, like what he's done for he this culture. He's trying to be humble. He's Aquarius like me. I know. Exactly. You know, we be humble, but we really need to pop our shit. Super right? important. Right? Super right? important, right? dude. Right? Yes. Right? Yes. Super important. I do have an interview. I have a bunch of interviews coming up. Mm -hmm. um, next week, I have Deshaun Forrest. He's going to be coming in. I met him at the one, uh, at the open mic at Noble Cinema. And then the winner of the open mic at Noble Cinema at the last the round is coming in. He won an 
interview. His name is Solo C. So he'll be in next Monday night as well they as Billy Bavgate. That's all right, right, all right, yeah, all right. Billy Bavgate is a legendary rapper out of Oakland, California. No, Play Bath on the radio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bavgate, hood to hood. Yeah, yeah. we got him. Yeah, yeah. A few little things coming up. For Big things. Big things. I, I didn't say little, though. I said few. Oh, I thought you said I said few. I wow. thought you did it. I said a few <laughs> things. You know, hey, Mai. I see you, Mai. I see you, Jules. Yeah. What up? What do you got going on, Tap? Oh, man. You know, just enjoying. This uh, this married life Nup since sure. I'm a, since I'm a newlywed, so I'm you know. Congratulations, thank you. Hey. And also, you know, I'm coming back here though, man. You know, I'm 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 doing something different when I come back this time to 360 Radio. I'm bringing the game show here, so okay. I'm gonna be called. Cool. So we already got it. I already got it. The draft work. So it's gonna be called politely speaking. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. So I was, uh, politely speaking. Yes, yeah, so I already got it. So that's what I'm doing. I'm doing when I come back this time. I'm gonna do like a podcast slash game show. Oh, dope! Okay. Yeah, so I'm coming back. Have the wheel right there. Yeah, so I already got my idea. Yeah, so I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I this used time to put things on episode. like slices on that, and I would be like, uh, "Chip is challenge," and you have to be like, "What?" You know, whoever did it the best, the chip is challenge, or the what else? The lav D. What else? Yeah. You know. So I got a little challenge like that. Got a little trivia, a little stuff. Big trivia. <laughs> so. Man, God damn. <laughs> <laughs> you get used to it. You get used to it. Going, oh, oh man, this you know. <laughs> no, I, keep, I, I keep saying the L word. You know what Absolutely. What else we got going on, man? You know, just uh, now that you know, life is. We, we had the baby. We had the uh, marriage. So now it's just beautiful. it's just time for us to pour back into our store. So you know, no. we're gonna take our um, listen the beauty supply store to the next level. So let oh, me right. end this. And let me end this with a warm and fuzzy. So I'm at his wedding, you know, and I met him. Um, through here, actually, mm-hmm. I interviewed him as a comedian. He had like a meme page, and then he came on as as a. Uh, oh, you didn't say he was a comedian. Yeah, yeah kinda. He's you know, I mean, I, I'm not, I, man I, of many yeah, I can make a, hats. I, I can make a, 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 a room laugh if I need. To. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. anyway, we meet. We you know we're like brother and sister. We've been you know kicking it. We do all these shows. We host these shows, and um, he comes on the network. He has a bunch of shows, and then he. He hit me up and he's like, yeah, you know, I'm having a baby, you know, and I was like, what? So he life just, hit me hard. He just had a Isn't baby girl. Second, no. no, it's not. Oh, but I'm just, oh, and it speaking it of, is. speaking of, Marquette, I just found out I'm going to be a grandfather. Grandfather. But, but yeah, wait, let me finish the warm and fuzzy. Okay, so we're sick. I finally make it to his wedding. I have never met his daughter. I've never met his wife. And he says, he grabs the mic from the DJ and he says, I need to thank two people. And he thanked me and he thanked his co host because he said that's how he wow. met his wife. Wow. I was in tears. That I was like, beautiful. Because it's just the reality of if, if, if I'm not seen here, I don't have them shows. Mm-hmm. Uh, she doesn't see me by watching those shows, so I have no wife. So it's like it was only right that if it wasn't for you, none of this would happen. Thank you. You know, sometimes yeah. I really do sit around and wonder, like, why am I, why am I doing this? You know, like I get in in those funks where I don't know the reason, and then things like that happen, and it's like impact. Even if it's that ripple of impact. Yeah, she found yeah. me on the Petty Bunch, too. One of them little, 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 little raunchy show, too. The little, the little crazy little the show. Sneaky Blink podcast. I had, I done had the Petty Bunch. I done had the Sneaky Link podcast. Too. Hella funny. <laughs> yeah. Somebody done stole the Sneaky Link and the Petty Bunch. It's all, now it's a whole new people on right. YouTube with it. But, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> already know who McGee was. Yeah. I was like, and you know, I ain't gonna lie, this ain't no offense to you, but I was like, this fight lady turned up. <laughs> yeah. I used to say that when I was, I was like, ooh, I'm, I said, no, I said that to myself, yeah. I want to be on her radio station, and it's crazy because how I came about was through mobbing. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And I always would say, like, I'm going to be on there. Because mm-hmm. it didn't matter how big the platform was, she was just always doing her thing. She was Absolutely. just, no matter who it was, and everybody came genuine with her. Yep. So and I'm that's like, how I'm going to be on there. That's, that's, yeah. that's, that's a beautiful thing. Went, and I met you through, <laughs> I met you through at Bosses Up, too. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's so how I got on here. We both mm-hmm. interviewed. Interview, from an interview, 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 interview the co-host. Let me tell you, shows. a lot of people could be my friend because I've interviewed a shit ton of people, <laughs> like thousands. And yeah. y'all, she's but hella, she's hella cool too. Oh, but she ain't yes, be. all That's my friends sit at the bars up. I would sit next to Katie. I would sit next yeah. to Katie. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for that. I appreciate it. All I am is just a weirdo that likes this shit a lot. All right, all right. <laughs> they a lot. not like us. They, they not, not like us. us. <laughs> so then there's a big controversy with Wayne and uh, the Super Bowl, and Wayne didn't get to be on, and Kendrick does, and they're like, Kendrick only has two hits. 
Well, they're bigger Man, hits than Wayne. Got way more than two hits. Well, that's Man, what they're Wayne saying. The but he's not from alive, that city. Period. That's what they were saying. Okay. Okay. Wayne is the best rapper alive, and they I'm have, a bad man. My thing, okay, he, my thing is, this is not the first time being in New Orleans, though. <laughs> so that's, if, that's if he, true. And then, and then and they, that's what they're saying. Yeah. No, no and it's been the mattering. They've been getting upset because they look at me. I'm getting all involved. We want that. We want that. Talk about it. They came to New Orleans. He was the hottest man in the world. Now he kind of like. <laughs> now he was hot, so he declined the first time. That's what he and I told him. Oh, okay. No, this way. <laughs> yeah, he ain't saying oh. anything. Yeah, he agreed with that. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. No, well, like, yeah, he's from there. I mean, I would have a gripe about that, too, because you guys always picking somebody outside of our city who don't know really what we going through. Let us sing about it. Let us get out there and dance. Enjoy about your that. hometown right, favorite. Question. If that's the, if, if that's, but they could have had them both. Saying, but if that's the if that's the case, then who will perform at the Niners Stadium when the Super Bowl there next year? <laughs> Right, you're right. Well, that's that's um, another topic. Um, that's what I'm saying, but that who, makes my eyes big. <laughs> you know who from our region? Forty. Who from our region who can handle a whole halftime short? Show? E short. Forty is short. Four. He gonna bring all his people. Are you not from who from our region that oh, they're gonna okay. put on a big stage? Uh, shit. <laughs> If it ain't, ain't, ain't G-Eazy Oh man like that, I don't see it happening We got the Super Bowl wars Going on right now <laughs> But the bars shout are up out to, Shout out to Bar Bird's up. Barbecue mm -hmm. Shout out to my family For coming out And helping my daughters They, They've been rocking with me For free oh, I appreciate them crazy. Well I appreciate everybody All y'all that, that watch me Everybody that's Even people that watch me When they were younger Like that shit inspires me To be here So I super appreciate it I really truly come here And there's an article About to be published published um de first degree de he published an article on sacramentorap.com that will be published soon mm -hmm. and it has a lot about me in there and it kind of explains that so um it is titled the lioness of sacramento rap so super right, dope to right. title the like he lioness. came with it. Lioness. yeah <laughs> i got my you know what i'm saying i got my own version of the shannon Sh sharp uh take coming out you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, you I'm feel me? Sh Sh Shannon Sharp ain't the only one, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I got my own version of Shannon. You got, got my Shannon, you feel me? I uh, have my Shannon shit going on. Oh, my God. Me J. Misha's like... Oh, Misha. That's my Misha. Yeah. I love you, Jay Misha. Come see me. <laughs> Thank you to Diablita for bringing the food. I believe that oh. it's this cheesecake that got me talking. Some Thank soup. you to Tap for making the drive. Oh, yeah. They got some infusion. Yeah. yeah. So y'all, this is what he's talking about over here. This yeah. cheesecake over here. This cheesecake is infused. It's going to grind. Wicked infusions. Crazy, you know? yeah. Wicked infusions. She was here tonight. She's yeah. from Stockton, here, California. Wicked like, infusions. <laughs> and then yeah. we got Crystal in the building. We got Simone in the building. Filthy Rebel will be at Young Bosses. Yay. I love Filthy Rebel. DJ Mighty Mike is going to be at Young Bosses. Yes, DJ Mighty Mike. Shout out to him. He's another one that just rocks. Yep, super dope. So yeah. come on out. It's Shout like out to the security that's going to be out there. It's going to be like a reunion for all the dope people <laughs> at Oak Park Brewery. Like, that'll be right. fun. Wow. What, well, the, and I'll end this on another warm and fuzzy. I was at the movies yesterday, and one of my old radio hosts, Miss Ashley's crazy ass, Miss <laughs> Ashley, she's out there. She was, like, with her mom to go see Beetlejuice. And she's all, Mom, Mom, she was on the radio with me, but she does it for a living. And I was like, <laughs> what? <laughs> Perception. <laughs> yeah, yes. I, I do. That's right. I said, I do, I do, yeah, you're right. Thank you, Ashley.